Nintendo's femme fatale bounty hunter is back. Samus steps onto the Brawl stage as a seasoned veteran, and die-hard fans will be pleased to know you haven't seen anything yet. At first glance, she's very much the opponent that she was in Melee and the original N64 version. Use powerful ground attacks to get foes airborne, setting them up for multi-hit combos. As always, charge up your beam constantly. Remember you can take your time with it to get it to full capacity and store it until just the right opportunity. In the air, fend off attackers by raining bombs upon them. And if they get too close, use their screw attack to tie them up. Use the screw attack wisely though, as it leaves you open for attack. Fans will also be pleased to know you have added missile capabilities. The Seeker is still available, activated by pressing forward before you hit the special button. It's great for adding incremental 5% damage and short range attacks, but only lasts about 3 seconds. The new toy is the green-headed super missile. It shoots straight and true as far as the eye can see, adding 10% damage. It's a great way to keep characters off the stage and to deal damage from afar. Now for the big reveal. For the final smash, Samus sheds her various suit and becomes Zero Samus. In this form, you're certainly sexier, but try not to be distracted. It's all about speed and combo attacks. Her basic blaster is weaker, but it isn't meant to be a tool of destruction. Use it to stun enemies and set them up for combos. But don't be disappointed with this lack of firepower. She more than makes up for it with a powerful whip. When you strike with it, it hits all around you. And like Mario's Meteor Smash, the farther away you are, the more damage it will deal. More experienced players will want to use her downward special smash for an evasive vertical leap. Use it to avoid anything that comes your way. If anyone tries to follow you, use her fast moves to kick them down. If you really dig Zero Suit Samus, here's a tip. Hold the shield button at the character selection screen until a stage begins to start the match in Zero Suit form. Also, at any time of the match, you can change into Zero Suit Samus by rapidly rocking the D-pad up and down. But be advised, you can only use this trick once. The final smash isn't just used to change form, it's also used to deal serious damage. And with each suit comes a different final smash. With the various suit, unleash a huge, powerful blast from her cannon. And with the zero suit, try to get in close and shock them off the stage. So there you have it, this diva's deadlier than ever. If you want to be a pro with her, it's all about balancing her suits. Happy hunting.